first and foremost, I think the um, chicken are coming home to roost uh, because they, we've been saying that uh, NASA is adopting a stridently violent approach to politics. It is basically exiting the rule of law and entering uh, to an, uh, another terrain uh, where you're using, uh, you know, violence. And then uh, what we have, co what has confronted us is um, the argument that um, uh, NASA, it is within the rights of NASA to protest, to uh, picket, to go to the streets that is provided for in our constitution. I think we've been debating bet between two things. One, the right to protest to the, the, the freedom of expression and freedom to do uh, what you want to do, which is provided for by our constitution. But we have not touched on the obligation to other citizens that you need to be, to be responsible. You cannot use acts of violence. Now, 10% of our population did not vote in this country. Uh, that comprised of about 2,220,000 Kenyans. Why? Because of total violence, uh, some of it so heinous, you don't want to mention it online. Yet, you were told the election was, pro I mean, it was boycotted. How can you boycott if you are beaten not to participate in an election? So what happened to the media is a wake-up call to the media to begin to turn to reason in regard to uh, listening to those who are saying, hey, we are moving towards a violent winter here.